Hello everyone, we have here exponential equation. 4 to the power of 3x divided by 2 equals 2 divided by 3x. And we're solving for the value of x. And before we start, for those new to my channel, I would appreciate it if you can hit the like button and subscribe for more videos. Thank you very much. And now let's start solving. And if we take a look at the exponent and compare the right side of the equation, this is exact reciprocal of the exponent on the left side. So what would you think will be the best way to solve this equation? So in here, we'll be using the uh, rules of exponent to find the value of x. Okay, let's do it. So 4 to the power of 3x divided by 2 equals 2 divided by 3x. So from here, I would like to get rid of the variable x on the left side of the equation. So the best way to do that is uh, raise the whole equation with the reciprocal of the power of 4 on the left side. So exactly the reciprocal of this uh, exponent. So I'll be raising the whole equation with this amount, the right side of the equation. All right, so the equation now becomes 4 to the power of 3x divided by 2 to the power of the reciprocal of the exponent, so 2 divided by 3x. That's the same way on the right. 2 divided by 3x to the power of 2 divided by 3x. So the equation now becomes 4 is equal to, since this, uh, we have this exponent being getting cancelled, 3x divided by 3x and 2 divided by 2. So this comes out to be 1. And the right side of the equation now becomes 2 divided by 3x to the power of 2 divided by 3x. So from here, 4 can be expressed the same way as 2 squared equals right side the same thing, 2 divided by 3x to the power of 2 divided by 3x. And from here, if you notice, the base is the same as the exponent. Likewise, on the right side of the equation, the base is the same as its exponent. So by correspondence, we have here a to the power of a equals b to the power of b. This just means that a is equal to b. So in here, on our equation, we got 2 is equal to 2 divided by 3x. So to find the value of x, we cross multiply. So this is now 6x is equal to 2. So x now is equal to divide by 6 or is equal to 1 3rd. So therefore, x now is equals 1 3rd. So this is our final answer x is one-thirds. We're now checking our answer just to make sure this is right. So we have to substitute the value of x to the original equation. So we are now checking our answer. In here is the original equation and we have the value of x as one-thirds. Substitute this to the original equation. So this is now 4 to the power of 3 times x x is one-thirds divided by 2 equals 2 divided by 3 times x is one-thirds. Simplify this. 3 times one-thirds is cancel. So left side now is equal to 4 to the power of one-half. And is this equal to the right side? So 3 times one-third is 1. So the right side now is 2 divided by 1. 4 raised to the power 1 half is the same as the square root of 4. And is this equal to 2? Square root of 4 is 2. So 2 is equal to 2. So from here we have just confirmed that the value of x is 1 third is correct. And so that's all for now. And for those new to my channel, I would appreciate it if you can hit the like button and subscribe for more videos. Thank you very much. 
Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next videos. Have a great day everyone. Bye.